Just last week, Infinite Warfare was revealed, and the internet went batshit crazy. Not only a week later, Battlefield releases their trailer. The internet sucked EA. Infinite Warfare's trailer has over 1 million dislikes on its YouTube channel. That is 1 million tips pressing dislike. We're gonna see what people around the world have to say about Activision's piece of shit. Um, Next flagship game. Just give you some room, man. You squished my dick in half. Meat chunks. Every year, I give Call of Duty a chance. It's my favorite franchise because I started playing it on Call of Duty 2007. But unfortunately, last years were disappointing. I play for two to three months tops and quit. It's not what I want. It's not what we want. I was really, <laughs> I was really hoping this year would be the one that goes back to the old times, but no. You were all futuristic on it. <laughs> Wow, that was deep, man. Star Wars Episode Eight looks great. According to, I think, Daisy released, she posted something on Twitter, Mark Hamill physically busted a nut on set. Them damn sharp rocks on the island peak. No! no thanks, I'm sick of this futuristic bullshit. I could give you 10 reasons why futuristic is the future. For one, it's the future. Two, SpaceX. Three, Austin Robo Evans. I don't even need to give you 10 reasons. I'm giving you more attention than you even need. Paul Blart Mall Cop is a better story. <laughs> I never watched Paul Blart Mall Cop. But hey, Kevin James, if you're watching, me and you can collaborate to make another, you know, Mall Cop. <laughs> Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Thomas, man. His show got canceled. That's why he's fucking here. Call of Duty is working at the corner, and Battlefield 1 is the king. I think if. They'd suck me off real good, but then they'd ask for like 50 bucks or 60 something after. Would you like a season pass go around? LOL, it's really bad when you're more happy to ride a horse than a spaceship. I imagine the horse's schlong is a bit shorter than the spaceship, so. What do I think about the Battlefield 1 versus Call of Duty fiasco? I think that we should really give Call of Duty a chance. I don't always eat out, but what I do, it's a booty hole. <laughs> Girl, that's a booty hole. So we're gonna read through some of those comments and see what The Rock is not happy with that disruption. Give me some wisdom. What should I do about this annoying Thomas the Train? Yeah, I'm gonna fuck him up. 